Are we rolling? Oh, we are. Oh, so um, my name is Sandeep Mukhi. I am an entrepreneur, a CEO, a business coach, a trainer, and a sales guy. I want to have a quick conversation with you, and you'll have to bear with me for the next few minutes. And I want to begin this conversation by asking you a few questions. First, are you someone who's recently passed out of college, is a graduate or a postgraduate, and is struggling to find a job? You are struggling to crack those interviews. Here's a fact: 1.5 million engineers get passed out every year, and the employability rate is between seven to ten percent. Now that's a that's a scary fact, right? Those interviews are a struggle. Second one: Are you somebody who is a great sales guy and wants to increase his or her? closure percentage wouldn't that be awesome or are you somebody who's got the dream job and now wants to get noticed by his or her peers colleagues and superiors so the question is how do you get noticed in this sea of people how do you get noticed in this huge pool of humanity the answer is very simple and very basic you create great first impressions now, this is the program that i want to invite you to be a part of how do you create great first impressions you go from this to this looking cool no um but can it be better let's change it again so let's go to to this this is cool right the first thing about creating great impressions and what people notice about you is how you groom and in how you groom the first thing that people will notice is how you dress now what kind of dress do you wear in a formal setup what kind of clothes are allowed in a semi formal setup what's casual wear and clothes is just one aspect of grooming grooming is much more beyond on what you wear Grooming is about how you style your hair, how you shave your beard, you know how how even uh, you smell. Thank you. You know I, I like smelling myself. I like feeling fresh and fragrant. Thank you. Um, even uh, you know how your oral hygiene is. There are just number of factors that will come into grooming, and we will look at covering that in this program. The next aspect that we will want to cover is your body language, right? I may be the most best dressed person in the room, but if I am like this, it doesn't make a difference. I can't carry my clothes. Your grooming, your clothes, the way you smell, the way you carry yourself has got to do with your body language. How do you shake hands with people? Do you carry yourself with poise, with elegance, or are you somebody who's cowering, looking at the corner of the room and trying to hide yourself? By the way, people create an impression about you in two seconds, even without you opening your mouth. That's how critical positive body language is. We will look at covering this in this program as well. The third aspect is your etiquette. There is a saying that clothes make it a man manners make it a gentleman what's the acceptable office etiquette how do you conduct yourself in meetings how do you conduct yourself in formal environments little bit of email etiquette uh, how do you conduct yourself in parties we will talk about that as well because that's what creates great impressions on people and finally the most critical part beyond all the stuff that i've said is your self confidence you need to be comfortable in your skin any amount of clothes any amount of body language etiquette will not work if you aren't self confident i will give you tips and tricks on how to carry yourself with super confidence in this program why should you listen to me yes you know i've had these designations which i shared before and yes i've got 
uh, you know, two international coaching certifications. I am a psychometric assessor. I have trained more than 25,000 people. I have coached more than 500 people and organizations as part of, of being a business coach. But beyond that, I am like you. I'm a small town guy. I had to actually struggle my way to come to the level that I've come here. I remember I had to go through eight frustrating interviews to get my first job. It was a nightmare and the confidence took a strong beating. I was thrown out of my second job in three months. And beyond the, the, the designations, beyond the adjectives, beyond the titles, I want to share my story with you. I want to share how I've reached here. I am somebody who's come up from the street and all these tips and tricks are not from a book but from a real life experience. Creating great first impressions is the name of the program and I'm doing this in a webinar format. Mark your dates. This is going to be on 23rd of January 2020. It's a Thursday. It's going to happen at 3.30 p.m. Indian Standard Time. This is going to be in a webinar format for 90 minutes only and that's the time I'm going to ask you to invest. Uh, more details will follow in the next few posts slash videos which I'm going to share with you. But you should mark your dates and block yourself. If you found this conversation insightful and you would uh, want to show your interest uh, for this program, please comment interested in the comment section and me or somebody from my team will get back to you with, the, with further information. In the end, I want to thank you for listening to me and giving me your time. I promise you the webinar is going to be worth your time and investment. The investment is not so high. It's going to be very, very cheap. Don't worry. Okay? See you guys soon. Uh, more posts, more videos to follow. Take care. Bye-bye. Hey, uh, sorry, sorry. Not a buy, not a buy. If you found this conversation good, share it, spread the word. Uh, your, your friends, your colleagues, your peers, anybody in the organization, you know, share this video. I'm going to put up this video in a lot of social media channels. You know, you could just go there and share it. I just want maximum people to get advantage from this webinar. All right. All right, guys. Thank you so much. See you soon. Bye-bye.